Hi, my name is Julia, and I'm going to show you how to convert a negative percent into a fraction and then a decimal. Now, let's pick a negative percent, say mm, negative 25 percent. Now, percent means to divide by 100. This is really 25 out of 100, so it's 25 one hundredths, excuse me, negative twenty-five one hundredths. Anytime you have a, a percent to just turn it into a fraction, all you need to do is take that number, put it over a hundred. You've got it. That's a fraction right there. The negative does not change how you do this. The process is the same as if it were a positive number. Now, converting to decimal, again, it's the same as if you had a positive number. Um, it's a little bit more involved than turning it into a fraction, because you actually have to divide by 100. So anytime we divide a number by 100, for example, negative 25, the one we're doing, you take the decimal point and you move it over to the left two spaces. You get negative 0.25, OK? So just again negative 25 actually divided by 100 means you move the decimal over two places. So you get 0.25, negative 0.25. That is the decimal of your percent. Um, and like I said, the negative doesn't change anything. It just, it stays there as a little negative sign. And that is how you convert negative numbers to a fraction and a decimal, same as using positive numbers.